Greetings and welcome to this Let's Write video. This video is going to be about 3D Maze, which is a maze game I wrote in BASIC. There's a re the representation of the inside of the maze using lines in graphics mode, which is uh, CGA compatible. But it works with uh, free BASIC for Windows and uh, Q basic for DOS. I'm going to list the source code so we can have a look at it. Okay, so 3D Maze for Q basic or 3 free basic QB GUI mode. So there's graphics, so you've got to use GUI, you can't use console mode. Um, and my website, use easy edit draw mode as a level editor. So that's just like this little text editor that, that you can draw uh, lines on the screen with and make levels for the maze. So at the top there, there's a declaration of some strings. Screen one for um, four color, 320 by 200 screen mode. Um, initial statements uh, menu. There's a, a little menu that pops up on the screen when they first run the game. loads levels. These are the built-in levels. There's only three of them. This is the top of the main loop. It clears the screen then it goes to the load. I'll get to the load later on. Uh, it prints some coordinates and things. So it gets some keystrokes here, and uh, user string is the string that has the keystrokes in it. So if user equal the up key, then it runs these instructions here. These um, provide paths or block paths based on uh, which part, part of the maze is in question. This is turning left and right, so it goes through and shuffles the directions if they t rotate. This is the load subroutine. So from any point of view, the little plus shape uh, ASCII character looks, looks like this combination of uh, line commands as a representation of the interior of a maze. So there's uh, all the perspectives for, dif for different uh, parts of the maze. So it's um, 716 lines long. Here's the title screen, 
arrow keys move, escape quits, load level from level.txt and M for map. So if I turn left, it'll show um, a wall. If I turn left again, it'll show another wall. That's because I'm looking into the corner of uh, the upper left corner. So this is the, if I go back to M, X marks the spot where I am at the moment, and the asterisk is the exit. Alright, so you found the end of the maze. Press space. On to level 2. You have found the end of the maze, press space. On to level 3. You have found the end of this maze, press space. Goes back to the title menu. But you can load your own levels like uh, This is what the level, a level I design looks like. The asterisk is the end of the maze and they start in the upper left corner of the, rep the maze. Okay, well that's all I was going to show you, so thanks for watching this video and have a nice day.